Good morning, Phil Pollitt here, Sutton About Town Realty in Waterdown, Ontario. It's uh, March 4th and spring is in the air. So actually it was minus 14 on my run this morning, but I'm going with spring is almost here. I'm going to do a recap on Waterdown for the end of January. End of February, I should say. And I'm going to show you five years here. Um, end of February sales, we were up 8% of February of 20 of last year and it's actually the same number of sales as two years ago in uh, 2017 2016 we were actually at 34 and 2015 at 39 so what you can see here is actually interest rates dropping and that's when our market started going crazy last year everything had kind of balanced out and we're actually gaining a little bit of ground on last year probably uh, the changes we saw last year have kind of worked them their way through uh, months of inventory is always an interesting story we are at uh, 50 homes for sale or available for buyers to buy in uh, as of the end of february and we were at 50 homes it's almost the same as last year down a little bit from 53 uh, so inventory backed off a little bit. Um, back in 2017, that's when our market was crazy. Uh, we only had 23 homes available. And in 2016, 33 homes. And in 2015, 37 homes. So end of February, we had 1.85 months of inventory. Again, that's actually a super low uh, amount of inventory. Um, so the demand is still quite strong and not a ton of houses uh, for buyers to pick from. Um, <clears throat> but buyers are uh, being a little bit choosier at the same time. So we're still riding in a balanced market at 57% uh, for sales to list. And to put it in perspective, average months of inventory in Canada was actually uh, 5.3 months of inventory end of January. So we still have probably the uh, tightest inventory in the country at this point. Um, actually, I haven't seen the Canadian stats out yet, but I'm pretty certain that that number is pretty low uh, compared to just about everywhere else in the country. Um, I always like to compare it against Burlington. So if I take a quick look at their months of inventory, they're just a little bit higher at 2.18 months, which again, very, really quite low. And they almost did the same thing as Waterdown as far as uh, the number of sales, and they were up 8% from the same month last year. So uh, really a, a healthy market. Um, there's not a lot of homes out on the market. Supply is still tight. Um, I know the Toronto Real Estate Board, I was reading an article there a couple weeks ago, or, and they were basically saying that they're lobbying the government to, uh, to reduce some of the regulations and increase the amount of buyers that can get into the market. Um, I'm not sure I quite understand that because our, our months of inventory is really and our supply is really low, but um, they, there's probably a lot of outside communities outside the GTA that are probably still hurting from the, uh, the mortgage regulations and stress test that was put in play. Um, but around here, um, we're still really tight on inventory and uh, very similar to that of Burlington. GTA or those numbers will probably be out today or tomorrow but I haven't seen them yet but I'll bet you they're running between two and three months of inventory as well. Just still quite low. So any questions at all about this report or about your home in particular, I'd uh, love to catch up and uh, go for a coffee. Have a great day. Bye for now.